and welcome to Modern Vibes with Dr. Jerry the First, episode 226. It's Friday, the 27th day of April, 2018. My names are Dr. Jerry the First, Oguzi. And this morning, I want to let you know that this mantra will help you change how you think about yourself. You have heard the popular saying that, as a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. And I am sure you have heard it over and over again. But what I am not sure of is if you have ever sat down with yourself to reason it out and actually understand it with the sole intention of fully utilizing it in your own life. All journeys of positive change begin with a goal and determination needed to achieve it. However, what do you think happens when you are too determined or too obsessed with a goal? You begin to nurture another belief. Who you are right now is not good enough. Over the past three months, I have had a client who has shown remarkable interest in working out and has really gained a lot from it in terms of body weight and shape. But she has become overly obsessive in her efforts to work out. As her interest in workout grew, she began to increasingly say to herself, I am not good enough, and I have to be better at this. She began to notice various imperfections within herself that needed to be fixed. In a nutshell, her over-the-top efforts to work out for extensive periods of time had opened the doors to lots of unexpected self-criticism and stress. Thankfully, with a little bit of coaching from me, she eventually realized that her obsession toward workout had made her forget one of the basic objectives of workout, self-acceptance. So the bottom line is this. You have to accept yourself as you are and then commit to personal growth. If you think you are absolutely perfect already, you will not make any positive efforts to grow. But constantly criticizing yourself is just as counterproductive as doing nothing because you will never be able to build new positive changes into your life when you are obsessively focused on your flaws. The key to remind yourself that you are already are good enough. You just need more practice. So, change your mantra from I have to be better to I will do my absolute best today. The second mantra is far more effective because it actually prompts you to take positive action at any given moment while simultaneously accepting the reality that every effort may not be perfect. Being able to distinguish between healthy striving and self-abuse on your journey is a critically important step towards living a happier and more successful life. And of course, if you are struggling with any of this, know that you are not alone. Many of us are there, right there with you, working hard to feel better, think more clearly, and get our lives back on track. Until I come your way again, this is Morning Vibes with Dr. Jerry the First. This program is powered by Top Top Media Communication Nigeria. All rights reserved. Thank you for listening to this broadcast today. It would please us to no end if you continue to visit our podcast. And so to be able to do that, kindly click on the red subscribe button towards your right to subscribe to our channel. In the same vein, also click on the bell beside the subscribe button so that you can always receive the notification for any new podcast we upload. Also give us a thumb up to like this podcast. These help us to grow. And do help us share the podcast to your friends in the different social media sites you belong to. Click on the share tab just below the podcast and share directly from there. 
The full text of this podcast is on our blog, and would you want to read it, kindly visit the blog. We have a Facebook page where we also post our podcast on a daily basis. If you're on Facebook, kindly like our Facebook page. The links to our blog and our Facebook page are in the description box right below. Thank you for your attention. Do have a very nice day.